In 1860, the city of Vladivostok was founded. This was a very important city for Russia because, after only a few years, it became Russia's largest port city on the Pacific. However, there is a huge distance between Moscow and Vladivostok, and sending tanks across the country was difficult. The Tsar Alexander the Third planned a railroad to connect the European and Asian parts of Russia. And in 1881, work on the Trans-Siberian Railroad began. It took decades to finish the railroad. Convicts and soldiers were put to work at both ends of the railroad, working toward the center. By the 1898, trains could run from either end of the railway to Lake Baikal, but the lake still blocked completion of the line. Lake Baikal is more than 600 kilometers long and over 1,800 meter deep. The only way to get passengers and cargo across the lake was by boat, until a special line could be built around the southern end of the lake. The Trans-Siberian Railroad was finally completed in 1916, connecting Vladivostok in the east. With Petrograd in the west, the passengers and cargo are still transported today along the railroad, with a 9,000-kilometer trip from Moscow to Vladivostok taking eight days.